Turkey is Istanbul International Airport is world's largest airport with 1,453 trucks working around the clock at the construction site. It set a new record for airport construction. It can handle up to 150 million passengers per year, which is equivalent to half of the US population. Turkey is also home to the fifth largest dam and the longest suspension bridge in the world, which are among the most impressive projects in Turkey and the world. In this video, we explore five of most influential and important Turkish mega projects that have established Turkey as a leader in Europe. Before we dive into these five projects, make sure you subscribe to our channel and get notified of our upcoming videos. 5. Yusuf Ali Dam Yusuf Ali Dam is a massive arch dam on the Chow River in northeastern Turkey. Yusuf Ali Dam is the highest dam in Turkey with a height of 270 meters from its foundation. It is also the fifth highest dam in the world of its kind, which is a double curvature arch dam. It has a reservoir capacity of 2.1 billion cubic meters and power station with three turbines that can generate 514 megawatts of electricity. The dam was officially opened on November 22, 2023, after several delays and controversies. Also, it cost about 487 million Turkish liras, it is about 270 million US dollars. The construction of the Yusufeli Dam caused the flooding of the Yusufeli village which was located near the Chow River, which was partially submerged by the rising water of reservoir. The government relocated about 7,000 residents to new apartment blocks nearby. The relocation process was completed in April 2023 and the citizens are trying to get to use to the new district. But some local and environmental groups were opposed to the dam and the relocation as they claimed that the dam would destroy the natural and cultural heritage of the region. The dam also affected the biodiversity and cultural heritage of the region, as many endemic species and historical sites were flooded and threatened by the dam, adversely affecting 21 nationally listed threatened plant species, including Iris tautia, of which all expect one art endemic to Turkey. 4. Aku Nuclear Power Plant the Akkuyu nuclear power plant is the first and only large nuclear power plant in the Turkey. It is located in Aku in the Mersin province, on the Mediterranean coast. The power plant is expected to generate around 11% of Turkey's electricity when completed. The power plant is a landmark project for Turkey as it will reduce its dependence on fossil fuels and foreign energy imports and increase its energy security and efficiency. The power plant will also help Turkey meet its climate goals as it will produce minimal CO2 emissions and avoid millions of tons greenhouse gases. The Aku nuclear power plant project started in May 2010 when Russia and Turkey signed an agreement that subsidiary of Rosatom would build, own and operate the power plant at Aku. Construction of the first reactor commenced in April 2018 and the first unit was completed in 2023. The second unit is expected to be completed in 2024 and the third unit in 2025 and the fourth unit in 2026. The power plant will operate for 60 years. The power plant will use seawater for cooling. The Aku nuclear power plant works by using the nuclear fission process to produce heat and electricity. The power plant used uranium as the nuclear fuel which is arranged in rows inside the reactor. The reactor also contains water which acts as a coolant and moderator. The heat generated by the reactor is transferred to the secondary water circuit, which boils water and produces steam. The steam is then used to spin turbine, which drives the generator to produce electricity. The steam is then condensed back to water and reused in the cycle. If you enjoyed the first two projects, please hit the like button and let us proceed to the third one. 3. 1915 Janakkale Bridge The 1915 Janakkale Bridge is a road suspension bridge in Turkey that connects the European and Asian shore of the Dardanelles Strait. It is the longest suspension bridge in the world with a main span of 2,023 meters. It was opened on March 18, 2022 to commemorate the 107th anniversary of the Chanakli naval victory during World War I. The bridge was built by a consortium of Turkish and Korean companies using advanced engineering and construction techniques. 
The total weight of each main cable is about 80,000 tons, which is as heavy as the 16 Eiffel Towers. The 1915 Jack Liberage has a positive impact on the travel time of boat crossing the strait. According to one study, the bridge reduced the waiting time for ship by 15 minutes on average, and by 14 minutes during peak hours. This is because the bridge piers are located in the navigable waterway, which creates a natural separation between the northern bound and south bound traffic. The bridge also improves the safety and efficiency of the navigation system by reducing the risk of ship collision and providing better communication and guidance for vessel. After you think this bridge will benefit Turkey's transportation, let us know your opinion and compare it with others. 2. Canal Stumble Canal Stumble is a planned artificial waterway that will connect the Black Sea to the Sea of Marmara, the us to the Aegean and Mediterranean Sea. The main motivation for Turkey to pursue this project is to achieve its vision of becoming a regional and global power. It will run parallel to the Bosphor, the natural strait that currently separates the European and Asian side of Istanbul. The canal will be 45 km long, 275 m wide and 20.75 m deep. It will have a capacity of 160 ships per day. The construction of the canal started in June 2021 and expected to be completed by 2026. The project aims to reduce the shipping traffic and congestion in Bosphorus and to create a new economic and urban development opportunities along the canal. The estimated cost of the canal stumble project ranges from $10 billion to $25 billion. Also, the government is expecting to generate $8 billion in revenue per year from the Istanbul Canal. The project will create a new business opportunity such as a tourism, trade and real estate. The project may also affect Turkey's trade balance as it will increase its imports of energy and raw materials. Before we move on the first project, make sure you subscribe to our channel to don't miss our next videos. 1. Istanbul New Airport Istanbul New Airport, also known as Istanbul Grand Airport, is the largest airport in the world, with a capacity of 150 million passengers per year. It is located on the European side of Istanbul, about 35 kilometers from the city center. It serves more than 350 destinations in 110 countries and is the hub for the Turkish Airlines. It has a one terminal building, which is the biggest terminal building under one roof worldwide. The airport is expected to have four terminal buildings and six runways when fully completed in 2028 and accommodate up to 500 aircraft. The airport costs around $10.2 billion to build. It is considered a major transport hub that connects to Europe, Asia, and Africa. The Istanbul New Airport has a 143 passenger boarding bridge in the first phase. It's officially opened on 29 October 2018, the 95th anniversary of the Republic of Turkey, with a ceremony attended by the President Recep Tayyip Erdogan. The first phase also enabled the airport to serve 90 million passengers per year. Also, a total of 1,453 trucks participated in a parade at the under-construction airport attempting to break Guinness World Record and celebrate the 564th anniversary of the conquest of Istanbul. The trucks were a part of construction fleet that was working on the airport project, which involved moving millions of tons of soil and materials. The Istanbul New Airport Air Traffic Control Tower is a 90-meter tall structure that was completed in 2018. The tower has a unique shape inspired by the tulip flower, a symbol of Turkish culture and history. The Istanbul New Airport has a distinctive exterior design. The terminal building has a wall to the roof of covers both the processor and the piers, and connects to the series of motor column grids. So, these were just a few of Turkey's mega projects. Which one of these five projects do you think will help Turkey the most and why? Please write your comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications to stay updated on our future videos. And now, join us to explore one of the most important mega projects, which will surely amaze you.